all right what's up guys so today is a pretty big deal okay today we finally have an all new finally an all new playstation exclusive video game ladies and gentlemen i would like to officially welcome you all to an all new series here on the channel welcome to returnal i just wanted to take a quick second to give a big thanks to playstation They've actually reached out and sponsored this video. They sent me a code for this game. I think this is probably the first time ever that we get a game directly from, from PlayStation. So it's a pretty big deal to me. You know, we work hard here and um, I'm just, it's a good day today, okay? Today is a really good day. If you guys don't know about this game, it's been getting fantastic reviews. I mean, everywhere across the board, it's got some in insane PlayStation 5 controller features like when it rains you can feel the raindrops i mean it is absolutely incredible and it is in fact a true 100 percent next gen playstation 5 video game so within returnal the story is pretty much about a woman by the name of selena who crash lands in an unknown planet and then within that planet there's some sort of ancient civilization of you know living creatures monsters and therefore now she's isolated and alone and she has to do everything by all means necessary to be able to survive and hopefully maybe possibly escape so that's pretty much kind of like a very brief synopsis of this game i'm excited and without further ado let's do this returnal is intended to be challenging experience each new cycle presents new challenges rewards and changes to the world adapt and preserve to progress further when you die or close returnal you will always be returned to the crash site and all non-permanent progression will be lost you can suspend your cycle by using the console's rest mode functionality what here we go Ooh, this looks... Ooh. I feel the little... Like, the little small pieces of rocks and stuff. I feel it on the controller. Oh, my God. feedback on the controller is insane. Approach for a bit. Woman, what are you doing? It's literally telling you, do not go there. <laughs> oh, she is courageous. I'll, t I'll give her that, right? I'll be like, nope. I'm going to bust a U-turn right here. And I'm going back home. I mean, we still don't know what she's exactly looking for. I don't. I don't mean to sound like a broken record, but I just experienced like seven different types of variations of vibration on the controller. I can feel the raindrops on the controller. This is incredible. This is Celine. 
I've crashed on Atropos. I survived, but Helios did not. Suit status operational, but my sidearm is missing. I'm leaving comms open. Movement and camera. Use L to move, use R to look around, and press L3 to sprint. Oh, goodness. This looks incredible. Locate the white shadow broadcast. So we just crash landed here. Can we jump? Yes. Perfect. Okay, do I want to kind of search around the area? Do I not? Ooh. Oh, man. By the way, I just disabled the motion blur on the settings. Hopefully that works out. Ah, oh, she's so she like it moves so fluid. Oh, okay. Abandoning Whoa. Helios. Heading towards White Shadow broadcast. Okay, the vibes are kind of creepy right now. Not gonna lie. I like it. I like it. Oh, this is sick. This forest contains extensive ruins of a xenotype civilization. Ancient walls, foundations, and statues. Investigate the signal source. Oh man, look at this. Dude, I know this story is gonna be it this is this is gonna be one of those stories that when everything reveals itself, it's it's gonna be kinda crazy. But hey, you know what? I'm here for it. What is this? Yobolites? Pick up. New data bank entry. What is that? Oh, okay. So it's kind of like a resource from the planet itself. Previously unknown radioactive mineral with a crystalline structure, uh, structure and a golden glow. Okay, I don't want to get ahead of myself and look through the equipment and stuff like that. I'll wait for the game to kind of teach me that stuff. Scout log, Atropos. I have found a deceased Astro Scout here. Checking identification on a helmet. It's. <sighs> Continuing towards the signal's origin. So hold uh, hold L2 to focus the aim. Press R2 to fire. And just press R2 to free aim fire. I cannot begin to tell you how good it feels to be playing a next-gen game again. So should we shoot that? I want to say... Oh, oh. Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Woohoo! This is probably gonna be health, undiscovered item, pre preliminary analysis, a safe to approach, potentially beneficial. Yes, of course. Discovered a potential resource. Positive analysis for suit repairs. Classifying as Silphium. Silphium. Whenever you see something green, you gotta pick it up. It's either money or health. You know what I mean? It's. <laughs> You can't. You never go wrong with the green. Now, I've heard this game can be very challenging. So, I don't think the rage has started just yet. But do not be surprised if we uh, experience some of that. A Xenotech gate secured with a lock mechanism. Oh, this, this world is so beautiful. I mean, it's creepy in a sense. But it definitely has its beauties. I take that back. That is disgusting. Oh god. Okay, listen here, lizards. I don't know what you are. What is this? Okay, okay. Oh god. Oh shoot. Oh, that's not gonna be very fun. Oh my goodness. 
Oh, we got a dash. Okay. Well, that makes everything a whole lot more interesting. Undiscovered item. Let's scan it. Retrieve. New log found. Adding to data bank. Playing back. Oh, she can play back right there. There we go. Okay. Atropos. Elapsed time: thirty minutes since last crash. Whole areas of this forest are rearranging themselves like a fluid puzzle after each of my. When. Whenever I return, per Astra Protocol, I will not be recovered until I reach the broadcast signal. If you're hearing this, you are stuck here too. Huh. I don't remember recording that. What the hell? The Astrobian Key. Okay, what is that? The Astropian Key. Resources. Okay, how do we use that? The Astropian Key. Are we supposed to do anything here? Maybe go back? Possibly? Oh, okay. So that's to open up that gate back there. Okay. I knew that, okay? I was just playing dumb all along. Don't worry about it. We got this. Anything back here? Okay. I like the scanner, though. That's going to help. So we've got the dash. You hold to dash and hold for a longer dash. Wow, nice. Undiscovered item. Huh. Fills one slot towards max integrity. Oh, snap. So we got three slots of that. Security system encountered. Okay. So here we use the dash. Perfect. That door opens. I think that's the only way we can go. All right. Let's head that way. Oh, God. Not more of these guys. Uh, enhanced. Oh, no way. Oh, God. Oh, God. All right. Listen here, fellas. I'm going to need you all to calm down. Okay. I'm just the girl that's been lost in this crazy ass planet. And I'm just just trying to find my way slowly but surely out of here. Okay? Oh my goodness. Area secure. Oh, I like that. I like that. It lets you know when there's no danger involved. Like, hey, you know what? <laughs> You're okay to calm down and relax. No need to be so tense. Everything's totally fine. Can I shoot that? One thing that I haven't really looked at, and I'm assuming this is the case, we have unlimited bullets. Opens uh, security gates and containers, but it's infected with... Mal mal malignancy? A uh, function probability low. Okay. Oh, crap. I couldn't read that. Negative effect sign from items. Remove uh, malfunction by completing the task on the left side of the screen. Increase dash cooldown. Collect. Wait, wait, wait. Collect. Uh... Is it these? 
15 out of 15 out of 150. All right, maybe we keep going. Let's see. Yeah, maybe we keep going. Here we go. What in the world is that? Should I jump in there, bro? <laughs> I've discovered piled corpses of a xenotype species. Likely the architects of these ruins. These could be the sentients that broadcast the white shadow signal. That is quite disgusting. Okay, let's see if we can get this malfunction out of our system here. What is this? Audio log? It is impossible to escape. I have tried everything. I'm always brought back by... There is a moment between death and rebirth when tentacles drag me down. Screaming, drowning, returning. So we've got to collect obelites. But I'm going to be honest with you all. I have no idea how to collect these obelites. <laughs> Let's see. Ah! Shit! Oh, freaking crap! Okay, okay, no, my goodness. No, 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 no. Oh, I'm gonna die. I'm gonna freaking die here. Ah, oh, what the fuck? Are you kidding me? Was I supposed to die? What is going on? Excuse me? What is happening here? Please tell me. <laughs> Thank God. Helios. Wait, what? Astra, this is Celine. I survived the... Can you hear me? I'm in my ship. What in the world? Dead status operational and I've already experienced this before. What is happening? Ship terminals. Helios has two terminals to use the main terminal and the challenge terminal. The main terminal can be used to view your overall statistics and ship logs information. The challenge terminal can be used to access the daily challenges where you can complete uh, compete against other scouts. this would be the online terminal overview hostiles eliminated oh oh we can sleep here too I just really hope that was part of the plan. I really hope that was part of the story, me dying. Because I've read that if you die in this game, you return back to the beginning or something crazy like that. It's probably still going to be nighttime, isn't it? <laughs> I only slept with the hopes and, you know, that I, that I could get through this during the daytime. I, I don't think that's going to happen. It's not going to happen. The cycle. Every time you die, you return to the crash site without the weapons, artifacts, and resources collected in the last cycle. Your databank entries and permanent equipment survive from cycle to cycle. Use the permanent items to explore new areas and utilize shortcuts. You've got to be kidding me. The environment wasn't like this before. 
Okay, y'all need to chill out, man. You know that? What in the world is this game? This is crazy. Okay. Oh, God. Oh, what? Uh, ether is a mysterious resource that is kept on death. Gain ether by inter uh, inter interacting with the decree scouts. The sea scouts. <laughs> Okay, we're just gonna get out of there. There's also another entrance that way, I think. What is this? Unknown device. Preliminary analysis, safe to approach. Lie down warning, interaction can damage integrity. Okay, let's, let's do it. Welcome to the unknown. Celine. This planet, it's it's just so weird. Oh my god. Grants 5% weapon damage for every 200 obelites carried. Maximum bonus pickup. Oh, yeah. Wow, dude, are you kidding me? Okay, relax, relax. I'm just, I'm just shooting this. Um, I'm still not sure if it does anything for me. We got to get out of here. As you know, we've got to go, I think, right. Can we go? Holy smokes. Hold on. Ooh. Oh, this game's going to be, oh my, a Xenotech gate secured with a lock mechanism. Are you kidding me? All right, let's head back this way. So how in the world? Okay. Could this be it? Maybe through here? I need some health, dude. Like right now. Malignant key. Open secured gates and containers. Oh, God. Come on. Fabricator costs increased by 25%. If there is anybody out there, I am well armed and quite dangerous. New technology discovered. Augments my weapon with an alternative firing mechanism. What? What be useful. the hell? I'm starting to think that me dying was all part of the plan. <laughs> okay, this was not part of the plan. This was not part of the plan. Oh, wow. So now I have to... Oh, so now I got to only tap the aim. Oh, my goodness. My God. Oh, 
Oh my god, wall hacks right here. Let's go, baby. <laughs> Let's get it, boys. <laughs> Can I use that against them? That's that's the real question. Huh. Man, I'm nervous. The fact that I gotta start from the beginning. This is actually insane. Enhanced vision. All right, I need some health, like right now, dude. Like, not, 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 not. Whoa, the frick is that? Yeah, I'm probably gonna end up pulling my hair with this game a lot. I can see it. The worn calibrator grants some weapon proficiency. Okay, we see health on the map. I think it's actually up there. Can I climb through here? Oh, snap, right here. Hell yeah. Look at this. I feel better already. <laughs> so it measures your combat ability bar cycle. You get proficiency from a hostile that you dispatch. There are also items that you can grant uh, they can grant you proficiency or affect your proficiency rates. How much proficiency you gain from dispatching hostiles and enemy. Okay, so your proficiency level determines the minimum level of weapons you can find in the world. Okay. The outfire. Your adrenaline level is raised for every three hostiles you eliminate for the maximum adrenaline level of five. While taking any damage, however, your adrenaline level is reset. Each level provides a unique effect, which... Stacks with each other. Malfunctions. Your suit can malfunction when coming into contact with malignant entities, such as containers, consumables, or even certain enemy projectiles. All of these have a chance to create a malfunction, triggering negative effects that can only be removed by performing the task indicated. Gaining a third malfunction triggers critical malfunction, which will destroy a random carried item. Jesus Christ. Oh... Oh my god. This 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 is crazy. Okay. Excellent. We continue. Hey, where's where's there's health here? How do I how do I get that health? I need that health. Could it be with the... Uh... Oh, maybe I can use my... Nah. Hmm. Okay, how in the world do I get that health? Let's see. Interesting. Yeah, we probably don't even have the ability to get up there at the moment. Oh, shit. Really? Okay. Malfunction probability high. <laughs> Undiscovered item. Prelim uh, preliminary analysis safe to approach. Potentially beneficial. Shield disruptor. Deposit into a matching device to permanently unlock this item. Designed for the future cycles. You can carry only one at a time. Okay. Whoa. What is going on here, Ralph? <laughs> My main priority right now, honestly, is I'm trying to scavenge for... I'm trying to scavenge for health. But what do we have here? 
Is that some sort of assault rifle? I think it is. Oh, that looks good. <laughs> I'm pretty sure now we could take down that freaking creature. We a xenotype weapon, similar to our carbine technology. Get much better, huh? Each weapon you discover has three properties: all fire stats and traits. And then traits: home missile. Homing missile and an armor piercing. All right. Now, what else do we have here? What is this? A Xenotech device. It requires something to activate it. Ah, oh, shit. Discovered a massive wall beyond which is the white shadow signal. I can't cross the chasm. For now, I'll change objectives and investigate the energy reading in the forest. Scout log, Atropos. Who triggered the broadcast? Do you see the white shadow is something only I should know? And now, out of literally nowhere, I'm hearing it again. Were the sentients involved? I need to believe there are answers at the signal. Hmm. Uh. Oh. What? No way. <laughs> what? Dude, my health is so bad. Is there a way to save? Oh, God. I'm going to die here, dude. Oh, God. Oh god, I'm so nervous. I'm so freaking nervous. My health is so bad. Let me tell you, the combat is phenomenal. Oh, this weapon is insane. They're everywhere. Oh, <laughs> shit. Bro, this gun is crazy. Telling me these guys don't drop health. What's going on here? Okay, I see health. I see it. I see it. And that. That's kind of creepy. I'm just trying to shoot everything, man. I don't know what works, what doesn't work. I'm just trying to figure it out <laughs> as I go. Okay. Okay, perfect. See, now I feel a little better. What is that thing, dude? Okay. Let's just head in through here. One day I will re-experience these 
same interactions from their perspectives. But are they truly me? Or just hollowed corpses? Hmm. This may be the face of things to come. Find a way to operate the Xenotech platform. Hmm. No, shooting doesn't work. That that typically works. Alright, so we keep moving through here. <coughs> Fuck this. All right, you know what? It's time we put our big boy pants on. And stop running away from our fears and face them head on. You know what I'm talking about? Let's go, baby. Nice. All upcoming weapons improved. Very nice. Get me some health right here. Hell yes. Some proficiency. No, actually, that's not proficiency. Proficiency is never, you know, never mind. <laughs> Grants a small amount of weapon proficiency. Okay. What is that? Oh my god. I'm gonna take that. Thank you very much. I will scan this. What are those grenades? Double suit repair efficiency. Repair enhancer. Xenotype device acquired. I think this will prove a useful tool. So it's filled with consumables that can aid your progress. You choose when to use them, but they are consumed on use. Huh. You initially, uh, you are initially limited to only one consumable slot, but you can carry multiple copies of the same consumable when encountering a new consumable. You always have the choice to swap out the item. And we will continue going this way. Oh, oh come on. Yo, I'm so scared. This has got to be like a boss fight or something crazy here. <laughs> There's no way. Yep. Is that health? Oh my god. Oh my god. Discovered xenotype technology on the corpse of a sentient. Scan is indicating potential for suit augmentation. <sighs> Appears safe to repurpose. <sighs> System integration complete. Performing a function test to confirm. Translocators. Your suit can now use translocators to teleport. What? Translocators. Tutorials. Oh, so this is like fast traveling? How do I use that? 
Is it through this? Oh, shit. Oh. Interesting, huh? Oh, crap. No. <laughs> oh, crap. Confirmed. Point to point teleportation. Location exit seems fixed. All right. Well, that's uh, that is quite interesting. So we're back here. Wait, weren't we here before? But now we can probably collect these things. Let me see. No, Xenotech still required. Well, I know there was another one of these things around here. Yep, there it is. This one. Nice. Holy smokes, bro. Oh, God. Oh, y'all really want to play rough? Oh, get right, nerds! <laughs> Let's go. So, for those of you, for those of you, what's really cool about this game and just overall the, the PlayStation Five controller features, for those of you that played it and have it, you know how the trigger is like. It has like two stops. It's got the soft stop, and then it's got when you pull it all the way. So when you when you do the first stop, it aims, and then when you pull it down all the way, then you get the other one. I think it's freaking cool. That is. Pretty damn cool. See, so yeah, I would jump down there, but I don't want to die. Interesting. Xenotype technology that produces other devices. Hmm. I see. Like a delivery bank. Insufficient ether. Integrity augment increase max integrity. What is this? Can I interact with that? Oh shoot. Grants a huge amount of weapon proficiency. Large hmm. good we're good for now i think we're about to fight some some boss or something i think we are we're about to fight something for sure evidence of rudimentary xenotype language discovered currently lacking resources to decipher this xenoglyph Hold on. Discovered a fragment of the Xenotype language. New data bank entry. Detecting a strange energy reading. Setting a marker on my map. What the freaking hell is this? Uh Nah, you've got to be kidding me right now. Goodness. A 
Okay. Can still collect the ether. Can we go upstairs? I know there was uh, some sort of transportation on the other one. Um, on the other room that we were at, I just didn't interact with it. I wanted to keep going forward and see what would happen, but... I don't know about this. Unknown device. Hold to scan. This is probably one of the... Uh, an inactive Xenotech device can be used to recover and increase integrity. Okay, let's do it. Interesting. I'm out. What? Undiscovered item. Preliminary analysis safe to approach. Okay, so we've got... I don't know. Should we swap it? I should keep this. I don't know. I'm a little scared. I like the automatic one. But this might this might be very strong. We'll, we'll, we'll keep this for now. I might actually regret this. Oh, crap. Fuck it. That's a translocator. Oh, whoa! Yo, what the frick was that, dude? like a shotgun now. Man, I don't know. I'm keeping this. Ah! I keep forgetting about those damn tentacles. Wait, did I keep the shotgun? Oh, I didn't. Let, let's be honest. I don't even know what this weapon really is. It's some sort of alienized equipment at the end of the day. Okay. Good. 
I did like the assault rifle much better. I felt a little bit more secure. And there we freaking go again. What the fuck? What have I gotten myself into? Oh, I'm gonna have a heart attack with this game. I swear to God. <laughs> this is really difficult. Okay. Now I'm kind of glad I came down here. Okay, this is good. This is really good. I wonder if we would have taken the teleporters, if it would have just been faster, you know? I don't know. We'll find out. Fascinating. I've discovered a kind of technology that records the past. Or a visual archive of sorts. The sentients encountered the same hostile fauna. Five ether to cleanse. That does not look healthy at all. Do I have five ether? I do not. Yeah, I'm not gonna do that just yet because you just you just never know. I almost just fell. What is our purpose here? Oh, what is that back there? Hold on. Should we do it? Let's see. Anti-energy pulse. Release an expanding burst of energy. It turns hostile projectiles. Don't tell me I wasted it. Oh God, are you kidding me? I thought it was like, a, I, I didn't know it was a thing that once you use it, <laughs> oh my God. Well, there goes that. And now I've got malfunction on my suit. Yeah, I feel terrible. What in the world? I mean, mine is better. Oh, it's the same thing. No, I will keep mine. Thank you. It's almost the same thing. Yeah. <laughs> okay, I think I think the objective is this way now. 
I don't know. I'm a little lost, bro. I need some help. I need assistance. Oh, hold on. Let me let me pick this up. Excellent. Oh, what That's the heck? That can't be here. What is that? That makes no sense. I think I am reliving my memories in that house, but <laughs> not fully. They're corroded. Some parts are missing, others seem manufactured. But I can remember the torment, feeling like I was losing my mind. There's no comfort here. No safe space. And the astronaut keeps following me. Twentieth century house, it's locked. Uh What what would this do? Okay, so this would teleport me again. Okay. Just gonna keep going this way. No, no, maybe not. No. Oh dear. Oh crap. No, I don't want to hang. Can I? Try this little gun. Could this be my handgun? Holy crap. That's actually pretty crazy. I still prefer my little uh <laughs> my little assault rifle. Thank you very much. Got a couple of undiscovered items here. No, we don't need that. That's for turrets. We don't have turrets available at the moment. Oh man, that 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 is insane. Okay, so we're definitely on the right path. It's it's gotta be. Got to be on the right path. There's no way around that. There's another enemy down below. Love it. Love it. Love it. I am the ultimate alien destroyer. Okay, do we have to go... Maybe that way, huh? Yeah. Interesting. Oof. What is it? Oh my god. Area in lockdown. Are you kidding me? Oh yeah, this guy. Oh man. This AR is insane. I can't even get out of here now. <laughs> this is hilarious. They've locked me in with these damn aliens. Look at that crap. Oh uh, yeah, that's that's not very nice. Oh what? Ah! Oh my boy, I'm out. I want no part of your friendship. Oh, 
<laughs> yeah. What in the world? Is it the same thing? Hardened, bonus damage. Ah, I'll go with this one for a little bit. I like how you can destroy almost all of those statues. That's that's pretty cool. Okay, so we've opened up the door. Um I think it was, uh, what? which way do we go? Oh, this way. Wait, no, this is where we came from, isn't it? What? Oh, it's not. What the hell? Or it is. Okay, I'm confused. <laughs> this is where we came from. If we go here, we've got to keep going. This is where we go. Yes, this is where we go. Oh my. I see the turrets now. Got a damn security system here too. This is this is ridiculous. <gasps> wow, I'm not even supposed to be here right now. I'm not even supposed to be here right now. <laughs> oh. Okay, so where the hell do I go? Hold on. What? How do I get up there? This is so weird. Oh, I see. Holy crap. Appears to be another teleportation device, but more complex in construction. a broken automaton clutching potential tool oh maybe to swing I don't know appears safe to repurpose oh. whoa a xenotype blade weapon what the heck how do I use that adding to equipment for immediate use oh no shit. <clears throat> oh, that's cool. <laughs> no. Oh, no. Was I supposed to do that? Could I have done that? Mainly to break. No. Yo, that's freaking cool. 
A large scale translocator. Requires a crimson key. So now we've got to head back all the way over there. Wait, what? Oh, shoot! So with that, we can break. Oh, we can break the barriers. Oh, that's cool. And the same goes for the turrets, I would assume, right? Yeah. Cool. All right, so if we go here... We can actually te teleport ourselves right here. Okay, that was really fast. What the hell? <laughs> Alright guys, so... I think we're going to end it here. Um, I do believe that we are... If you didn't know, there are boss fights in this game. There's bosses and stuff. There's like, you know, the regular enemies and there's, and there's like big bosses. Um, from what I've seen. But well, we're going to end it here. Um, this is quite exciting. So uh, if you guys would like to see more episodes, let me know. Drop it a like on the video. Um, it does help out the videos and the channel grow. And it lets me know that you guys are enjoying it. It's definitely a very unique and different experience than a lot of the things we normally play here. Just because of the whole save system and how you die and you start from the beginning. That's a little scary, so I've been playing a little bit cowardly. But uh, to my defense, I don't, I don't want to die, okay? But nonetheless, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Hope you enjoyed the game, the episode. Um, again, a huge thanks to PlayStation for, of course, giving me an early access code and sponsoring the video. Thank you so much. And most importantly, thank you guys. And hopefully, hopefully I'll catch you guys on the next one.